people actually credit you as the most accomplished footballer? Well, I'm, I'm a little bit, uh, how would I say it? Uh, blush. <laughs> I started to play football actually through, through all my brothers. Mm -hmm. we, we have a, I have a big family. Mm -hmm. So there are about 14 of us actually. Wow, 14! <laughs> my first national call up was with. Uh, with uh, National team, I think was, I was 17 years old. My next target was, okay, I want to do uh, my, my license in Germany. The highest coach, coaching license is uh, in German, we call it Fußballlehrer. The beginning was, uh, was nice because it was summer in Berlin and Berlin was beautiful in summer. For the Southeast Asian uh, players that has no experience at all about uh, the weather, it is not easy. Uh, Bayern Munich, we, that is the biggest team in Germany. Yeah, yeah. Thomas Müller, he actually said he credits the style of football that he plays today yeah. to you. Okay, that's news to me. But, that's uh, news to yeah. you. Yeah. yeah. And, and you, you made him write what it means to him, uh, what the word team yes. means to him as yes. a 12-year-old. Is that yes. true? Yes, that's true. Wow, what did he, he write? <laughs> well, uh, you, you see, uh, when he was playing for me in under 13, not only uh, Thomas Müller. I had uh, under 13. We had. Uh, I had even uh, uh, some other better players than Thomas Müller. Better than yes, yes. Wow. During that time, during that time, you know, when they were 13 years old or 12 years old, rather 12 years old, and I told them to write down what does it mean by team for you. Mm -hmm. You know, I said to them, I want to see what it meant for you. So every players had to write. What it meant you to know? them. Yes. So even today, I still have all those... Uh, all those uh, Essays, yes, almost. Yes. Wow. Yeah. And, and, and he says, the team means we work for each other, whether in good times or bad times. That's, that's what uh, he, he wrote, you know. So I said, very good. Do you think he has embodied what he wrote as a 12-year-old now? Oh, yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, I would say this gentleman, because of his family background, you know, they are, the, I know their parents very well, because when you work in, in under, when you work with kids, you you must have contact with the parents as well. You know, so I know their fam fa families or the parents. I know their parents. I know his parents, and uh, we used to change uh, information. You know, and and because this this gentleman got a lot of support from his family in a positive way. You know. And uh, because of that, he grew, he grew. And we allow him, I allow him to grow as well. I don't put any, 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 uh, uh, how could I say it, put any restriction on what you should do and what you should not do. The only thing that you should not do is not to, not, not, not to, if you don't come to training, then yeah. of course not, you know. Yeah. So, uh, and, and he was, he is a very intelligent boy. You know, and, and in terms of talent, he was not as good as certain boys those days, you know. But because of his, of, of his uh, 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 what do you call this, uh, we call it Werther in, in German, I can't remember the... the <laughs> uh, oh, you think in German now yeah, already. Uh, his his uh, principles in yeah. life, you know. So it makes him a better player. Okay. Because he was, he was, uh, uh, he was fighting in training. In training, uh, he was giving his best, his desire to improve, his desire to work in training, desire to learn. Is greater than other players. So eventually, he, he, of course, he improved. Did you earmark him as one of the names that to be remembered? I mean, this is going to be a big name in the future. Oh yes. You did. Oh yes. I mean, I don't have to. He's already one of. Yeah, he's, I mean, he back worth, then, basically. He's worth about 30 <laughs> to 40 million right now in, in, in Bayern Munich. Yeah. yeah, you know. And now, when you were coaching Bayern Munich, were you ever intimidated with the fact that you are in this country, football is a religion, mm. you are in the biggest club, coaching yes. the, you know, one of uh, all the biggest yes. names that will come out from yes. this club. Yes. Were, there, were there any moments where you went, wow, can I do this? Yeah. Well, I... I I have no doubt about my ability, yeah. but of course I face this challenge, but I don't allow this challenge to, it, to, 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 uh, 
to uh, dictate. dictate me or to, to make me feel, feel weak. No, I have a very strong confidence in my ability. Mm -hmm. And these people, of course I face these people. It, it does exist, you know, anywhere you go, yeah. it does, especially if you are a foreigner, you know. But then, uh, then again, I don't allow these things to happen. Mm -hmm. I put my foot down if something is not right. So in other words, you must be strong mentally and prepare for all these kind of things. Yeah. You said the support that Mueller had when he was a child was most important. Yes. You have children yourself. Oh, yes. And you yes. have a son who yes. played uh, in yes. the junior yes. level of yes. uh, Bayern Munich. How were you trying to balance you know, this? Uh, well, it's, it's, uh, it is not easy because I know uh, to understand the players, young players at this age is very important because to play for Bayern Munich, just to put on the jersey, the pressure starts to come yeah. because everybody wants to beat you. Even the blind and the cripple will want to play. <laughs> they will, well, they, morbid. <laughs> yeah, they, 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 I'm, I don't mean to insult these people, but yes. they want to beat you. Yeah. They want to beat you, yeah. you know? So, in other words, if you are not prepared mentally, yeah. you, you have no chance at all. You have no chance. So, the pressure is very great. When you put on Bayern Munich jersey, it comes automatically. Yeah. So, so, I could see during uh, games that these players couldn't cope with the stress as well. So, mm. so, at a very tender age, you could see they couldn't cope with the pressure. So, I saw it with my own eye. So, when my son wants to play for Bayern Munich, if he doesn't really like it, so... It's up to you. I said, I, I advise him, it is not easy. I understand you. you. But you choose what you want to do. So I don't, I don't put any pressure on him. Because some kids, they, kids, they are very uh, uh, direct, you know. Yep. They can tell you, you are here because your father is a coach. Mm, <laughs> wow, did he face that? Oh, yes. Oh, oh yes. So he didn't like it either. So you should have put him in the Dortmund camp. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you should have done. Yeah. Were you yeah. ever disappointed that your son did not you know, go on to become a professional player? No, not at all. No. Well, How about I... your daughters? <laughs> 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 Jeremy has a good you know, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. female no, setup no, no. as well. Uh, no, it's no problem for me. I know being a footballer or to be a footballer is not easy. It's very difficult. It's very challenging. And you have to face a lot of uh, disappointment, mm -hmm. and uh, and not everybody will achieve success. Also, you know. So, well, like I say, this is his uh, his uh, his future with in football. So it's up to him to 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 uh, choose. You know. Yeah. So it wasn't heartbreaking. It was just no, kind of it's no, okay. No, no, not at all. Not at all. My me and my wife, we are quite relaxed on all this. This is just, for me, this is just a, a game. Mm. You know, football is just a game. More to come on Cinema Unplug. The structure of football must be changed. Yeah. The infrastructure of football must be there. And later on Stadium Unplug, do you feel like you want to contribute a lot more to the landscape of football in Malaysia? Mm.